going on guys? This is Blaine back in the video. Well, it happened guys. I told you guys this would happen. We have our first confirmed case of a burnt 12 high power connector. So the most alarming thing of this story is the connector on the power supply was melted, which to me would mean the GPU told it to suck more than the connector can handle, which means the sensor wires were messed up on the power supply and the cable just couldn't handle the power supply spikes at the 1590 FE it was asking for. Which to me equals the video needs to get back to the drawing board since they want to keep pushing this new connector down our throats since they want to keep playing fuck around with electricity and find out. If you don't understand that the GPU can can and will pull more than 600 watts of the power supply at any given time, considering most people are probably going to be gaming for a couple hours, all these power spikes will destroy the cable and even the power supply. Since again, it was only supposed to be rated for 600 watts. Now let's get back to the cable. This cable was a third party cable which obviously NVIDIA does not approve, but it did power A4090 for two years without issue. So I don't really see that as being a problem, and obviously he knew how to plug in the connector for the first time, so why would that be an issue? Anyway, yes, the cable from NVIDIA is improved, but not that much as far as I'm concerned. It's just marketing and not improvements. Why would you try to implement a new connector that does not have the proper sense pins so it knows if a specific pin is pulling too much power and ends up melting the connector? And the pin? Like, seriously, why these mistakes are so expensive and unnecessary? AMD doesn't care that they still use the tried and true 8 pin and 6 pin connectors, but yes, all pins from the power supply and the GPU were hurt during this. But yeah, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below, and uh, please like and subscribe if you like this content, and yeah, have a good one, guys.